Hi everyone, we're going to talk about the uh, safety procedures for using the drill press. Uh, again, first five are always the same, but operate with the instructor's permission only. Uh, remove any jewelry, eliminate loose clothing and confine long hair. Make sure all guards are in place and operating properly. Always use proper eye protection. All materials should be inspected for defects and warps and not contain any foreign objects such as nails or staples or any other things like that, which could hurt you or cause damage to the machine. Um, some specific areas of the drill press. Do not wear gloves when operating. Uh, it's a spindle machine and gloves can catch into it and cause your hand to be pulled into the cutting surface. Guards should always be in place with any machine. Clamp your work to the table and the long stock should be placed to the left uh, of the cutting surface. Uh, the reason why the, the reason why this is is because the, um, the rotating arm that moves the drill up and down is on the right and you want the bulk excess of any material to the left so it's out of your way. Um, and most importantly part of that there is you need to clamp your work. Um, if your drill bit is really large, it could dig into the wood and um, the wood can become loose if you're not clamping it. Uh, and can spin around at a quite fast speed and could smack you in the fingers and can really hurt. Um, you can even break your hand. Uh, make sure the ch uh, chuck key is removed from the chuck before starting the machine. Uh, the chuck key is what we use to uh, tighten uh, the chuck around the drill bits, uh, and I'll demonstrate that uh, when I do a demonstration. Make all adjustments with the power off. Okay. Uh, adjust the table depth so avoid to drilling the table. We have a, a cast iron table, and we don't want to drill into that. It's quite a hard service, break a lot of bits, but also provide a damage it as well. So we don't want to do that. Uh, never perform any setup or layout work on the table. Um, the table that is there is used for drill press operations only. You don't make things on top of the table. Uh, make sure the drill bit uh, or cutting tool is locked in the key chuck and in good condition. Um, never use any cracked out bits, one example. Use the recommended speed for the materials you are drilling. The harder the material, the slower the speed. And the reverse is true as well. The softer material, the faster the speed. Um, you don't necessarily have to worry about the speed of the drill. Uh, it is preset for wood and uh, since we only drill wood in the shop, um, we don't be changing it. Uh, we just uh, need to know information. When finished, uh, shut the power off, remove the drill bit, and cutting tool and clean up debris. Very important. And that's the safety operation of the drill press. Thank you.